Welcome back. Today we're going to work on s'more cup stacking, but today we are going to create the six stack. So before we can get to actually stacking six, you need to be able to pick up three. So take whichever hand you want to start with, and you're going to pick up three cups only, just three, and then put them back down. Then try again, pick up three, down, three, down, three, down. Practice that a few more times. Now try with your other hand, because you need to be able to do it with both hands. So remember, you're picking up three, putting them down. Three, make sure you let go in between. Three, two, one. Hands flat on your lap or on the floor. Next, we're going to work on the six stack. Watch first. After you pick up three, you are only going to pick up two. Okay, so it'll be three, two, and when you end up stacking it up, it will look like a lovely pyramid. Now, pick whichever hand you want to start with, pick up three, pick up two. Now I'm going to call this hand the three hand because there are three cups in it. Throughout the entire stacking process, I will call this the three hand even though the number changes that's in it. So this is your three hand because that's what you started with, this is your two hand. So you start with the three hand, then you go two hand. That has created your base. Now you're going to work on the middle level. Start again with your three hand, two hand, three hand. Does that make sense? Okay. We'll go back after we down stack. For down stacking, you're going to hold the top cup with one hand and the second cup with your opposite hand, but they need to be on opposite sides. So you can't do it this way because it's just very awkward. So you could do it this way if you want. It doesn't matter as long as you have one hand on the top and one hand on the opposite side. As you down stack, you are going to slide your hands away from each other to stack those up and then you put them all together in one stack. Okay, let's up stack again. I'm going to switch hands. So you pick up your three cups, pick up your two cups, three hand, two hand, three hand, two hand, three hand. One hand on top, one hand in the middle, slide away, stack them in. Let's go one more time together. Three, two, three hand, two hand, three hand, two hand, three hand. Slide away, stack together. I will, let's give you some time to practice. Practice on your own. Decide which hand you want to start with. Remember to start the stack with your three hand, whichever hand that is. Go ahead, get some practice in.
Finish your stack in five, four, three, two, one. Good work, that's pretty tricky. We're going to add some challenges to our stacking, just like we did last time with the three, three stack. So we'll do two up stacks and down stacks. And after you've done two, we're gonna do four lunges, wide lunges on each side. So you're gonna take a giant step to the one side, one, come back, two, three, four. Then come back to your stack, and you're going to up stack, down stack, up stack, down stack. Then more lunges, four lunges. One, two, three, four. Come back to your cups. Four lunges. Five, four, three, two, one. How many did you finish? It's a great number. This time, we are going to do uh, four leg lifts with a plank. So you can do a plank from your forearms or you can do a plank from your hands, but you're gonna lift your leg four times. One, switch legs two, switch legs, three, switch legs, four, switch legs. Then you're gonna up stack and down stack again. Think you can handle that? All right, we'll give them one minute. See how many cycles of double stacks and plank with leg lifts you can do. Remember, it's four leg lifts. Get yourself ready. Get, look at those cups. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, 
One. Catch your breath. You've been working hard. Our last challenge for today is going to be five shoulder presses and two six stacks. All right, so for shoulder presses, you have to stand up. So stand up for your shoulder presses. One, two, three, four, five. Then come back to your cups. Think you can handle all this? This is the last one. Stay strong. I know you'll be great. Get yourself ready. See if you can beat me. Get ready. Get set. Go. Well done. So that was the six stack. I hope you enjoyed learning that next technique. I'm sure you have been very successful and I look forward to seeing you next time.